How do you feel when your parents told you they're going to send you to an all-white school? Um, actually, my parents didn't tell me that. Uh, the only thing that my parents said to me about attending a different school is that I was going to be going to a new school and that I should behave myself. You must have been afraid as you walked, walked to school through a mob of angry people shouting at you. Were you aware of the danger? How did you overcome your fear? I was never really afraid because I wasn't um, quite sure what was going on at the time. It seemed like Mardi Gras because in New Orleans I'm accustomed to Mardi Gras. Mm -hmm. So I wasn't afraid um, for a very long time. What was it like to be the only African American child in the all white school? What I do remember about um, first grade in that year is that it was very lonely. I didn't have any friends and I wasn't allowed to go to the cafeteria or play on the playground. So what bothered me the most was the loneliness in, um, in school every day. How did your first grade teacher, Miss Henry, touch your life? Mrs. Henry had a huge impact on my life. Mrs. Henry became my best friend, so she wasn't just my teacher. She was uh, my only friend in school. The mere fact that I didn't have other kids to play with it was just her and I, and she made school fun, so um, she really made a huge impression on me. When you visit schools today, what strikes you most about how different it is from when you were a kid? Um, what strikes me the most? That particular year, as I said, I was alone, so it was totally different for me the second year because then school kids were together in school and the mere fact that they were both black and white together was totally different from what I had been accustomed to. Today I do see schools that are uh, diverse and mixed and I, I think that that's the way schools should be. I don't think that um, racism has a place in the hearts and minds of our children and um, so I think that all schools should be diverse. That's totally um, not the case across the country. I do have opportunities to visit schools that are still somewhat segregated, and I think that's unfortunate. What impact do you feel you had on desegregation of schools? Uh, truly, it changed the face of education in our country, because up until you know that, that day when I entered school, the laws kept us segregated. And after entering the school, um, every child has the opportunity to kind of choose their own schools. And children have the opportunity to be with people that look different, which would allow them opportunities to make friends with people that are different. Um, so yes, I think that I had a huge impact on education.